What is going on everyone? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Uh, I am that one Sneed, but uh, today we're going to be doing a video comparing the G30, G35 coupe and my G37 coupe. Well, mine's an S. He's got like the sport bumper on the front. Right now he's currently cleaning the inside of his car for the comparison, but <laughs> yeah, welcome back to another video guys. First I'm going to plug Tanner. Uh, his Instagram's going to be like right there or right here somewhere. So one of like the main differences about the G35 and G37s, the G35s, they are a little bit thinner and the G37s are a little bit wider. Uh, they have different tail lights. Excuse how dirty the cars are, there's salt all over the roads. These wheels of course on factory. These are factory S wheels. They are the factory S brakes. I just painted them red. Hey, go ahead and pop your hood. We'll just show them the engine. Keep the new carbon hood, guys. 700,000 miles. <laughs> 700,000 miles. But he just had a new carbon hood today. This is a VIS carbon hood. He also picked up a VIS carbon trunk, too. So for those of you that don't know, this is the VQ35 DE rev up from, oh, was it 05 to? 05 to 07. It's a 06. So this is a 06. The 05 to 07 G35s come with a rev up motor which they feature more horsepower, but less torque. And they also redline at like 7,000 7, 7, RPMs. He's got an intake, he's got full exhaust, tune. So the G37S Coupes, if you can get it. They don't come with this bumper OEM. This is an OEM IPL front bumper and IPL front grille. Hold on, I got you. <laughs> <Blood dip. laughs> so the G37s, uh, they were made from 2008 to 2014 or 2013 and they come with a VQ37 VHR with uh, the manifold has two intakes on it the rev up DE only has one stock I think these make like 245 wheel like bone stock and bone stock with these I think they make like 270 wheel horsepower or something like that so it's like a 30 wheel horsepower difference um, if I'm wrong, correct me in the comments. I'm not a Nissan god, but I love Nissans. <laughs> but yeah, so those are like the main differences right there. Um, they come with a different transmission, different motor. Uh, of course, the whole car looks different. This body style is older. It's more simple. I'm actually like really into these. Like I love those. So yeah, spec D headlights. These, of course, are not OEM. My headlights are OEM. Come around to the back of the G37. They usually come with like the um like the letters right here, but I took it all off because I didn't like it. I also have a diffuser on the bottom right here. Those are not stock tips. That's like a Manzo axle back exhaust. Nothing crazy. These cars are basically one year apart. The 07 is the exact same model as this. This is an 06. This is an 08. G37, this is a G35, and this, you have anything to say about this car, like, to add to the video? It's a very reliable car, I love it, <laughs> and I wouldn't trade it for anything else, I love this thing. <laughs> so I used to have a DE, and my car kind of blew up a few times, but he has had, like, really, really good, like, reliability with this car. Um, I've had good reliability with this car. They're really good daily drivers. Like, I daily drive mine. Do you daily drive yours? Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> I drive the crap out of it. You definitely get a lot of attention with these cars. Like, when you go to gas stations and stuff, like, people look at you. Like, when you pull up, everyone just, like, looks at you. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> it feels like a weird way of being famous. Like, I don't, I don't know. But, um, yeah, those are, like, the main differences. I'm going to show you guys the interior. So, this is the interior of the 05 to 07 G35 coupes. They come with like the silver down the middle and black leather or tan. Some of them come with tan. Yeah, this one came with black. The, okay, well yeah, this one came with black, but I think some of them come with tan interior, I'm not sure. But I mean, even like the buttons right here are the same as my car and my car is like newer by one year, but if it, if it, uh, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I guess Nissan kept like the, you know, the same buttons all the way up till now. They have the same buttons in the 2018s, 2020s. <laughs> but it's pretty simple. I'm gonna come over to the passenger side for you guys. Look at this view. 
This view is amazing. So I'm coming over here to the passenger side. It's pretty simple, nice and clean. Nothing's like, nothing's too crazy. I like a shift knob. <laughs> Uh, sorry. Heated seats, all that, all the good creature features. We've got the sunroof, you know, and all the clock and everything is like up there. Show off the Rolex. Show off the Rolex? Where's it at? <laughs> oh, the, the, the freaking clock. <laughs> That's funny. So that is the inside of the G35 Coupe. Like I said, guys, obviously the wheels don't come stock. The hood doesn't come stock. Like, that's all aftermarket. But these wheels are stock on the 37s. I think the G35 coupes come with like stock 18 inch wheels, right? 19. Oh, they come with stock 19s, okay. Well, it's the Zs know. that come with 18s. Yeah. So we come over here to the inside of the G37. Here, just, <laughs> here, <laughs> hold on, here, here. Okay, she's gone. That was probably really bad editing, but she's gone. So the inside of the G37 coupe, the steering wheel is obviously a little bit different. The center console is obviously a little bit different. Um, do any of the G35s come with screens in them, in the middle? Oh wait, no. no. I just added mine. Okay, so when you turn the key in the G35, the screen, I think, comes up? Yeah, on some of them. On some of them? Yeah, Not on all of them, but on some of them it comes like that. Um, in the G37, you have like the silver trim that comes all the way around. It's nothing crazy, it's just, I'm just showing you guys the, like the small differences that come in the car. Chick-fil-A cup. So the gauges in the G37s, my steering wheel is turned right now, it's locked. But the gauges in the G37s, they actually light up like purplish blue color. And then the G35s, they light up orange. Um, these come with heated seats, same back seats basically. Nothing crazy, sunroof. That's like the same buttons that's in his car. The same buttons on the door handle. I feel the focus. But that's like, that's all the key differences. And in like the 03 G35s, if you guys are looking for like an older model, the interior is going to look different. Um, it might come with the Brembo's on it. Some of the older G35s come with the Brembo brakes on the front. But the 05 to 07 usually don't unless someone aftermarket, aftermarket we did that. I don't know, I don't know the word for it, but... Uh, stock, the G37S coupes come with um, these Aki Bono brakes. They just come like a stock silver and say Infinity. And the Brembo's would usually come orange with like a black Brembo symbol on them. But... But yeah, guys, that's that's pretty much it for this little comparison. It's nothing crazy. But we're not gonna race the cars because literally, like, I'm not trying to on the G35. I'm just speaking facts. This car will beat this one, stock for stock. It's just that's just how it is. <laughs> that has a rev up. That has a VHR. Uh, that's the DE VHR DE VHR whatever. But the G35 coupes never came with the HR unless you had the sedan. But <laughs> oh, one other thing, the 03 to 0, 03 and 04 G35s came with like an older transmission that are like known for grinding gears and stuff. Synchros. The synchros go bad in them from 03 to 04. But 03 to 04 also has like the cool brakes. But Bumpers. they <laughs> also the 03 to 04. I think the wing is different. The wing is different, it like hangs off the side. This one just stops right there. But the 03 to 04, it like comes all the way over and like hangs off the side. But that's it for today's video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you did, drop a thumbs up. You don't you don't have to drop a thumbs up, but like it, it would be nice. <laughs> His stuff is in the description below. That's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a thumbs up. And uh, I'll see you guys when I see you guys which is in the next video, but peace.